me to say? Yes, I'm doing a speed run, uh, Twox Bro. The other thing is, like, I probably would not be streaming tomorrow. Probably not. I want to speedrun tomorrow, but then GameStop is opening for midnight release for the new 3DS and Majora's Mask, and I, I am going to go for that. So I'll probably just try on Friday. Probably. Definitely Saturday, though. I know MN space is faster than Z space, but Z space is just more uh, swag strats. Like, I want people to beat my. If I get a good time, I want people to beat my time. I just want to do uh, some more swag stuff sometimes. Like, I go less optimal movement on certain parts of the run. Like, okay, so put it this way, Decon. I get out of practice around 8 p.m. Um, give me about 30 minutes to drive. Then about another 30 minutes to eat. Well, 30 to 45 minutes to eat and get food and whatever. So that brings about 9.15. The line opens around... 10 p.m. I'm probably gonna go there around there 10:30, so that's like an hour, 15 minutes. I could potentially stream. Now you take away 30 minutes, up to 30 minutes of resets. That's like minimum 30 minute stream, which I don't like doing. I like to do at least an hour. All right, yeah. Decon's kind of answered that question. Sorry, I was like trying to ramble on was trying my plan for tomorrow. Um, yeah, my aim is just try to get to the Hall of Fame as fast as possible. Nice. Nice. Not nice. Great. Okay, the crit would be really good at this point. I haven't had the most ideal Terminator fight yet. Where it's... I think it was like... Um, a couple crits. And then a 9 crit, I think? 11, 13. Okay, this is like... I would say a good app. This would be a... Uh, Above average rival time. Average is around two fifth, uh, two forty-five, and three minutes is pretty bad. The time does get shifted if I pick up a potion or not. But in this case, since I'm going, ah, I'm going without a potion. Yeah, two forty-five is about the average time. Two thirty is the best time, and three three minutes is just pretty awful. At some point, I do need to get an encounter. I do need to find an encounter this time. So, my stats are uh, 11 attack and 13 special. I don't have the ideal attack. Ideal would be 12. And, well, special is like, it could go either way. Like,. Being level 8 to catch Missy No is very helpful. But then you have to waste time to catch a wild Pokemon. I don't know, not catch, but uh, fight a wild Pokemon. But it's also more safer too. Please be level 2. Catch all Pokemon run with glitches would take around two and a half hours. Min um minimum two twenty, I think I could say it couldn't average around two forty five, I'm not sure.
But Decon, you need to sub the random Miser 151 run. Get the world record in that, Kappa. I can fight. That is not level 4 though. Level 4 means I need an extra turn to uh, fight. So I gotta fight a different one. Level 3? Level 4. Even worse. Okay. I haven't fought a wild Pokemon yet. New plan. Fight it at Route 2. There's less of a chance I can find a suitable counter, but it's what I had to do. What is a glitch run? A glitch run means you're using glitches, where versus a glitchless run you don't use glitches. It's a very uh um strong term for that. Like it's not There's a bait on whether something is a glitch or not. But outside that, it, yeah, it's pretty much defined as two categories, glitch and glitchless. I mean, it's not a dumb question. Like, if you don't know, it's not a dumb question. I'll fight this one. I haven't used any glitches yet. Um, but it's gonna get there soon. The earliest it would be at the next split. Like, glitches and using codes are two completely different things. Codes as in like using game track or action replay. Or game GD if you're uh, if you know how to go that far back. Good, I skipped it this time. I've been debating whether I should skip this potion or not, but for me to skip this potion means I have to get. I had to get one less Pokeball. So that ball is an antidote, which I bought earlier. I need six items to do a item duplication. I already bought one in the Pokemark, and it's actually faster to buy in the Pokemark than to uh, pick it up. That's right, I've been trying to debate whether or not should I pick up that potion or not, but it's a cost of one less Pokeball. The fun start- like, all the glitch stuff starts at the second half of this run. Assuming I can live, I am not going to use my potion. And this Weedle is relentless. If he crits, I die. If he doesn't crit, I have two- two turns of- uh, poison sting. Okay, now I need 16 special, which is very likely good. Now, the other part is that, um, to activate Brock through walls, I need to, uh, I need to. Uh, have a Pidgey with 17 HP. 
which is could be either when I caught it, it could be either 17 or 18. I don't know. I didn't look. It's slower to look, so I'm just going to take my chances and go for it. And we'll see. It's okay time. So, if I have 18 HP, the game will crash. If I have 17, the game will continue. So this, that was the first glitch where I get to skip Brock, because that guy will try to prevent you to um, go fight Brock. But I somehow uh, I pass him like that. Alright, we gotta run. So now I know that's a 17 HP Pidgey. That's great to know. Now I'm doing less optimal walking, just to let, for Decon to know. Why? Because I get to show off, I get to walk over the guy like here. And here. Yeah, I'm basically walking through walls. Walking over mountains. It's not hacks, it's just the game was just badly programmed that allows you me that allows me to walk over things. But I think it is still PV pace. Uh how I do that. Um it's not easy to explain right away. Because it's, um, th there's a ver lot of technical numbers needed to uh, help set this up. But basically, that guy that uh, tried to make you fight Brock, he will. Okay, let's uh, let me deposit this first. Um, he wasn't in the program. He wasn't programmed to be uh, top from the right side, so. It allows you to do certain special things in the game. That time loss is expected because I use PC. Old route doesn't require you to use PC at that point. But this new route is going I'm gonna use that PC there. So if I want a PB, I should Um do this within like five tries. Now, I want to get an encounter in front of him. He's a trainer, but if I die in an encounter in front of him, more fun stuff happens. Like I said, Decon, I've been debating whether or not I should stick to uh, PB first or not, but probably not from plus minutes. So if I do this within three tries, it's actually faster than getting Abra. Three tries! Bellsprout though, that's the worst encounter I can get. Thank you, James. Yeah, Decon, it's not- you can save. So what happens is I'm supposed to die, and then I break the game even more. Thank you! Boss part is just... It takes a lot of time, but he has the weakest attacking power to kill Bulbasaur. Now the fun stuff. So I set up an... And that route down there that thinks I should be in a battle, but I'm not in the battle right now. So, I'll just do this. I am gonna fight this guy over here. Ah, that's too far. And then die to him. Probably is. Slower. Okay, good.
Yep, that's right, Decon. You get to save even a little bit more time by doing that. Okay, ground twice. I would ground three times if I had level seven. Then heal twice. So my punches get duplicated in that OD ordeal. And I'm gonna do it one more time by catching him. Let's see if I get to catch him. If I don't catch him, I'm, I lost PV pace. It's about 10% per Pokeball. So I need to see two shakes to guarantee the catch. Because the way the game is programmed is that the number of shakes determines the percentage chance to catch the Pokemon. And you see normally one shake didn't break. So when you see two, that means you caught them. Got them. I know, he didn't use Sky Attack, I was surprised. I was not expecting a PB like this, but sure, I'll take it. Okay, now I swap this here, toss this. I'm pretty sure I did it right. Then I access to other areas of the game where I normally don't should have. There we go. Yes, this is the first completed yellow route with dry underflow. As I'm aware of. Okay, Decon, please take care of him. Please take care of him. <laughs> 16 minutes in game time. Now that's a solid run there. That's like second run for the night. Okay, that's I don't know what place that is. It's not it's top five, I think. I let the music run too while I'm at it. Top sixth place. Alright, I'll take that. Yeah, the thing is that... Um, you have two Pokemon in your party, but I'm not like going back to my PC to deposit the right on. Why would I do that? Um... The record for this is by Decon, who's in my stream. Uh, 1721. Also, it's also on console. Then that he didn't do like the route I did. He did a little bit safer route, but you can see how much time I can save from the red splits. That could save a lot of time overall. I guess. Well, yeah, Braille Spot also helped kind of slow down the run a bit. But, I still have at least a good amount of time saves left. Because 16 minutes is very, very possible. 
with the route this route 